Hello guys, today's vlog starting out a bit differently. I am cutting my own hair today. Well, not my actual real hair, but my wig hair because I'm doing a film project which I know I keep banging on about, but it's like a very, like, I don't know, dragged on process. And one of the things I have to do is be in a wig, but I've got this like, grey wig thing, which I had since um, two years ago when I did a video about testing Halloween wigs. So, and I kept all the wigs because I thought, oh, I might need it for something else. So, um, and now I do, but the only thing is I don't need is this long grey wig. So I want to make like a spiky, you know, like short spiky hair things back in the 90s. Well, I'm trying to achieve that look by cutting off some of this wig hair. So here's all the collection of wig hair which I've just cut off. So um, that's a lot of hair. But it's kind of like failing miserably because this like wig's like very sort of like shaggy, like it's like stringy. So. Every time I stroke it, like bits of hair just like comes off and it makes my wear quite hairy. So I've even got quite a lot of this film thing, but um, yeah, it's all good. So I've kind of managed to successfully cut my hair. So I decided to go for this like long look. It actually looks like real hair, to be honest. Like I think I might have actually done quite a good job of it actually. Uh, despite me not having any hairdresser experience. Like I think I might have to do quite a good job actually. The other thing is there's not like bits of hair flying everywhere so I'll have to hoover up afterwards but it actually looks real like you know like wigs sometimes just looks like wigs not actual real hairstyles well I think I've actually managed to successfully cut my own hair like I've started to add some bangs at the front well is it is, it, is bangs what the Americans call I don't know but I've always known as it is bangs because I've always watched like, American YouTubers say that um, but I think it's like, well, me, well, it's a fringe in the UK, but um, this looks like something I've actually, I used to have like years ago, like the mushroom hair um, phase. But I don't know guys, like it actually looks really good actually. I've managed, I've actually done quite a good job actually, even though I didn't have much faith in myself because I was like cutting hair just like not consistent with length, even though it looks not consistent now, but um, I don't think the, um, the film will reveal any of that, but yeah, I've always wanted to like kind of like go back to my fringe phase. Like I know I used to always make fun of my mushroom hair face, but I've always wanted to have like a fringe again, like have like hair fringe. Cause I haven't had it in years, but I've seen like other men have like hair fringes and they look quite good. So I'm gonna try and model their styles, but I really want to have my hair fringe back. Like, I don't know, I've been thinking about it for months now and I don't know guys, maybe my mushroom hair might be returning. You know, the mushroom hair me might be making a comeback. Okay, so I'm back to my normal hair with also a tinge of red hair now because I use a red wig. But anyway, um, I did most of my filming project things so I felt quite productive even though I thought it was crap um, because I was gonna do this like filming projects and I had all these like, ideas but only kind of all fell through so I had to like, kind of improvise and uh, it was just a crap job but well, it feels a crap job, but I think when I edit it, it might not be as crap. But anyway, we'll see. Um, but yeah, uh, I'm just glad that green screen bit's over now. Um, I can at least get some order back and just retidy everywhere because everyone's a mess right now because of this filming project. This is my bedroom and everywhere's just a mess. So I had the wardrobe here for all day because I was using this bit as like, like an office area thing. So. But not so much an office thing where I put a green screen over there, like all these like walls like covered in green screen. I'm not sure if it works or not though. Um, we'll have to see when I edit it, but um, yeah, but I'm gonna put this wardrobe back now against this wall. I need to put those, my pictures back on there as well because I took that down. So everyone's a bit of a mess right now, but I'm sure I'll um, go back together again. Okay, wardrobe been moved back, success. Now time to put the pictures back on there and have my desk become a desk again. Okay, right, one thing about having these like pictures, like, I have like a collage frame which like goes and where these like drawing pins are. And um, one thing about doing a collage frame is that it's actually quite hard to like, put it back again because I have it in like a certain sort of fashion, like a certain sort of way of doing it. And so it's like really hard because if you don't put it in like a way that I've, I've put it in specifically, like it becomes odd and it becomes a bit ski with so I have to try and calculate and work out um, how the hell I've done it. To be honest, I should have really took a photo of like the collage thing because now I have no idea how on earth I'm gonna put this pictures back, but I think I've kind of 
Got the gist of it. Okay, I am making crumpets right now, but oh my god, guys, like, why is crumpets so good? Like, the crumpets, I feel like I'm always buying crumpets because I'm always eating crumpets. Like, I'm gonna look like a crumpet very soon, but I buy crumpets all the time. I don't know why, but isn't crumpets, like, literally holes in bread? Like, it's legit just bread with holes in it. But it always tastes so good. Like, have it, like, really crispy, like, so, like, burnt-ish. And like with like loads of butter and it tastes like amazing. Like why does it, why does crumpets taste so heavenly? I don't know why. Um, but it tastes really good, so we're having some crumpets, but um yeah, I was gonna make a cake, but I decided not to make a cake because um I'm like so tired and I might make a cake tomorrow actually. So let's start. Um don't know what else to say really, uh, except for that today's been quite weird. Um bit like, I don't know. A very weird day. Probably because like everywhere's like messy and I've been doing lots of things today and but I woke up like really tired as well even though I've had like eight hours sleep. I woke up today and I was like ugh not feeling it so um I think it must have been an all day thing but um that's probably really <laughs>